Hi guys, a very good evening. Masura say, Masura say, Masura say. Let us talk about important matters. I know that it's late, but we have to talk about this. Job Sikala is um uh, actually spoken at last, and um when he spoke, he actually clarified something, something very important because a lot of people were waiting for Job Sikala to come out in the public, clarify his position, or tell the people of Zimbabwe, what he thinks about what is happening in the opposition. So let me take a look on what Jessica said here. He said, Job Sikala saying we didn't do anything for his release is wild business. If you ask me, what did he do when God's war and others were incarcerated before he was arrested? Did I miss the memo of demos matches or we were all meeting at the courts sending foodstuffs? And raising awareness. Okay, let us talk about this. Job Sikala, several fundraisers were done for Job Sikala. Yes, they were initiated by popular people, but we all participated in those fundraisers. A lot of people participated in those fundraisers. Echo Cash numbers were sent several times. People paid through Echo Cash to support Job Sikala. We did videos after videos for a very long time. We were doing videos about Job Sikala and at last, Job Sikala comes out and says, I was not supported. You were not supported by who exactly? So Nelson Chamisa went to the prison. He was blocked. He was denied access to Job Sikala. That is something else to Zimbabwe. It's painful to say I wasn't supported when Nelson Chamisa was there. Nelson Chamisa went to the courts. Very close people to Nelson Chamisa organized a lot of things for Job Sikala. But remember, we had a lot to uh, actually focus on. We, 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 we had the elections in 2023. Triple C was bankrupt. There was no money. President Nusun Chemisa needed to do the campaigns, needed to meet everybody. What was a priority? Um, releasing Job Sikala and winning the election. We, we must understand that, yes, re releasing Job Sikala was uh, important, but winning an election, bringing democracy to Zimbabwe, was more important. So, because the issue is not about job seeker only. The issue is about how many people are being incarcerated, how many people are being victimized by this regime, how many people are going missing, how many people are dying. Take a look on all spheres. Job Sikala must be grateful. Let me play this video for the people to understand what Job Sikala had to say on his own. I want to give myself time to reflect of what has been happening and what has been the cause and foundation of the current acrimony among the protagonists in the current opposition political organization. Secondly, I also would like to say it very openly that neither of the current protagonists in the peril and conflict within the opposition ranks did absolutely nothing about me when I was under incarceration. So there is nothing much that will interest me in their conflict. These are the people who neglected me while I was in prison. They have never raised a finger. There is nothing one which can be pointed out that they did for the sake of my freedom out of prison. It was only left to my family and to close, to close friends and allies for them to fight for my freedom. Okay. So it's becoming interesting, Team Zimbabwe, that we have people who will never appreciate, who will never be grateful. Personally, I feel for, for President Nelson Chamisa, he's a man who is facing a lot. He's facing people from his party. He's facing uh, people he trusted. He's facing the, the, the people from, from, from ZANU-PF, uh, the other 25 president from the opposite. He's facing a lot as an individual. G40, everybody is after President Nelson Chamisa except the citizens of Zimbabwe. The last hope for President Nelson Chamisa are the citizens of Zimbabwe. This is the capital of support which people like Job Sikala are trying to actually take by hook or crook. So they want to use this incarceration as a way to pave way for Sikala's uh, popularity. Okay, it doesn't matter, uh, but he was supposed to actually appreciate something. President Nelson Chamisa did a lot. We did a lot. Isn't, isn't that 
because we are not popular, we are not acknowledged. Everybody shared about job seeker each and every day. People retweeted. People made noise about job seeker. But nobody cares. For several times, President Nusun Jamisa spoke about job seeker. What was he supposed to do? So personally, I find it this difficult to understand what what is really happening? What, what, what are these people uh, uh, um, for? This reminds me, I once did a video, and in that video I didn't want to say much, but I spoke about certain individuals and certain people who sold out job seekers so as to sell a different narrative, which was meant to divide the opposition, uh, divide President Nelson Chemisa, and people like Job Sikala. And Job Sikala fell for the trap and has actually joined the cabal. But does it matter? Yes, to his followers, it matters. But to me, it doesn't. Because what I'm looking for is a new great Zimbabwe. What I'm looking for is a free Zimbabwe and equal Zimbabwe. That is the reason why you see people like Freddy, they, 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 they refuse to, 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 to remove themselves as their double candidates. They contested and lost. It's, it's coming out right now. Will he survive when his uh, 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 tortoise failed to survive in St. Mary's? I doubt. So this has been ongoing for a very long time. And when President Wilson Jameson says, okay, I'm distancing myself from Triple C and I'm focusing on the national issues, he's right. Because these are the people who wanted to use President Wilson Jameson to continue fighting the factional battles of Triple C. Why least there is something greater to fight for? I now believe that there is need for, for President Nelson Chamisa to actually uh, reflect and, uh, and, and, and find a new team. There is need for President Nelson Chamisa to find a new team, build a new team, and start everything afresh. I've seen a lot uh, in, in the past few days. I've seen a lot. So, Tim Zimbabwe, here's my message. Let us remain vigilant. Let us remain careful because the regime is using each and every measure it can to make sure that they suppress the people further, to make sure that they stop Advocate Nusun Chamisa. The only man who is feared by this regime is Advocate Nusun Chamisa. Forget about the job seekers' arrests. These were choreographed by some people who only wanted to, to nail Nusun Chamisa on something to Disrupt, uh, disrupt nose on Chamisa on something. But the major question is, are they going to win? Remember, several demonstrations they called for and they failed to kick in because President Nelson Chamisa said there was no need for us to demonstrate. Yes, they created a task force led by Masarauri. That task force failed as well. So, personally, I will not be part of a uh, Child's play politics, uh, the problem is not him. I think the messengers were not telling him the truth about who was doing what for him. Okay, if he was not being told the truth, he must come out, reflect, meet and each, each, meet each and every person, have time on social media, take a look on what people were doing, and then. Uh, you, 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 you make a decision from that. Advocate Fadzai Mayere uh, posted so many times, so many times, each and every day, Advocate Fadzai Mayere could post about job seeker. But at last, he's saying people did nothing. He don't even care about people like Masai. He, what, what, what is happening to his family right now? He doesn't even care. He doesn't even care about other people. He is the only person who's supposed to be cared for. Yeah, guys, Zakaoma. Zakaoma, honestly speaking, Zakaoma. Uh, and the, and the hashtags are very useless. Action on the ground was needed. What kind of action? Why is it people like you will be failed to do action on the ground? What can, kind of action? Who was supposed to be shot at? Who was supposed to be killed? So should we have people being killed on account of freeing job seeker? Should we free job seeker with multiple uh, graves, with hundreds of graves? Honestly, I find it difficult to understand, guys, 
Kuti, okay, since he was arrested, we were supposed to lose more lives. There are so many people who risk their lives talking about job seeker when he was arrested. So many people. Personally, I was intimidated several times. It's several times I was intimidated. But they don't even care. Guys, I have never seen anything, anything like this. I've never seen ungrateful people like this one. But um, it is what it is. We expect it in the struggle. It, it happens. So, the job should relax, gather first hand information, brainstorm, and move his first step. He's rushing things he re that rarely works. So, and the combo stay, stayed inside for some time, but he never said we didn't do anything for him. What we um, exactly uh, expected to do? So, and it's not going to, to be a long road. Okay. So, uh, personally, Team Zimbabwe, we are going to watch and see how this is going to end, but um, I feel that Job Sikala has made a mistake, and that is the reason why I didn't want to talk much about Job Sikala in the past few days, because there was a lot of information I was getting um, at the end, and I didn't want to share that information, but given the circumstances, given that he has given his own side, he has taken a side, then I believe that I'm free to talk about all those issues and we'll continue to talk about them each and every day. It is what it is, Tim Zimbabwe. I do not know what you think. In the comment section, please let us have this discussion. What do you think?